Hello scientists, welcome to Drawbound Mad. So this video I will show you an, an artwork that was made by a scientist subscriber. So Clever Cleo is a neuroscientist and she has made a graphical abstract for, uh, about the metastasis of cancer cells and based on the uh, blood vessel tutorial that I I made posted here on the channel. I was really impressed by the good illustration that she has made so uh, I asked her if I could present it here on the channel and she agreed to let me uh, show you guys how um, she depicted this uh, metastasis scientific story through her graphical abstract. So as you can see it here that she has uh, used the draw vessel tutorial to create its image and uh, I will also show you my uh, original uh, tutorial illustration over here so you can see uh, where she has added some of her personal touches and also her personal style. And I will also link you to the uh, tutorial over here at the card. Uh, if you click on the exclamation mark, then you can find the link that can lead you to this uh, specific draw blood vessel tutorial. I will also tell you a few things that I really love about Clever Cleo's Graphical Abstract. So the first thing is I really like that she has add extra parts into uh, the blood vessel uh, illustration so it can fit into the storytelling better. So uh, as you can see here that she has added some of the um, leaking blood vessels uh, with some of the blood spilling out. So this is a really... Uh, a very vivid way to communicate with your readers that there are some entries that uh, can uh, lead to uh, the invasion of these cancer cells. So that is a very good way to uh, tell the visual story and so uh, this is really well done. The second thing I really love about it is that she has add her own personal style uh, into there that uh, you, you can see the color is slightly different, also the shape that she uses is a little bit different from the tutorial that I made. So this is the uh, this is something I really love that uh, you guys can start uh, adding on adding in your personal touches into this illustration that uh, you don't need to follow my illustration tutorials like exactly as how it is. Uh, you can definitely add into your personal creativity into your graphic abstract and that can uh, really make these uh, graphic abstract your own and also uh, I know that this research can be very personal to you it's uh, you spent a lot of time putting into this research and um, studying the science of these topics so uh, it would be really great that you can put into some of your own personal uh, artistic style into your illustration so uh, people can see that it, it is your personal work. Here Clever Cleo has done that uh, by really uh, incorporating her personal style and her own personal inter interpretation of the tutorial into this uh, graphic abstract. So uh, I really love it about that. Also, uh, she has made the graphic abstract into a carousel, uh, which means there are multiple images in the same Instagram post. So you can swipe it through uh, as slides or in some way like a comic strip. So uh, you get this kind of movement in the storytelling. It is such a great way to tell a scientific story so uh, as you can see here that uh, she has made two graphic abstracts. So the first one uh, depicted that there is a leakage in the blood vessels. And then in the second one, you can see that some of these cancer cells has migrated into the blood vessel and start traveling to other parts of the body and cause metastasis. Um, so this is a, such a uh, creative way to use a, a carousel and also these comet strip kind of uh, storytelling step by step with the different images. And she also has used the uh, visual storytelling principle very well, which is uh, when you are when you're creating a sequence uh, of actions, and then uh, it, you always should have the 
some recognizable elements within each sequence. So the readers can anchor themselves in the story. And, and then that can also act as a contrast to the part that is moving. Uh, in the case of Clever Cleo's work, the, the overall big blood vessels and also the overall tumor stays the same. And then some of the um, parts have changed and moved in the second illustration. So uh, then uh, readers can really follow through the action that you want uh, to them to draw attention on. And, and also then they can see that, then they can make relation between these two illustrations. So this is a very important storytelling technique in, in the, um, when you have a sequence of actions. So this is a very well done, uh, very good job, Clever Cleo. I'm really happy that you have tagged me on Instagram so I get to see this uh, great work that you have done. As, so I really enjoy this process of interacting with you guys and also seeing your work. So if you have created some graphic abstract that uh, you would like to show me, you're very welcome to tag me on Instagram and also on Twitter so I can uh, take a look at them. And uh, if you like me to uh, share them uh, to the subscriber scientists over here, uh, also please let me know and I'm very happy to uh, give you a shout out. Uh, also, uh, Clever Cleo is a neuroscientist who uh, is studying how microbes in the guts affects the neurodegenerative diseases. It is such an interesting topic uh, because I think I have read some of the articles about this that in recent studies, uh, the gut is started, like the, our digestive system is starting to emerge as part of um, the system that will affect our brain. It is really fascinating. And uh, at least I think in the articles that I've read, it is related to depression. Um, so if any of you guys are studying this topic, please uh, leave in the comments and let me know uh, more about this topic. I find it very fascinating. I would love to learn more. So uh, yeah, let me know in the comments and so uh, yeah I really look forward to seeing more of your work and and so make sure you subscribe to Drawbound Med and also turn on that notification bell so when these uh, new new uh, shout out and also new works that is showing up then you get to see them on the channel and I wish you all happy Drawbound Med and I look forward to seeing you in the tutorials